trying crispy pata in Filipino restaurant, Kuyo Jays. For today's video, we are here at Filipino restaurant. Kuyo J restaurant is famous for Filipino dishes. A casual dining restaurant that offers great Filipino gastronomic delights. Here are some of the glimpses of their menu. Feel free to pause the video. They also have some side dishes and upgrades for solo meals. There are plenty of choices to choose. They have varieties of beef, chicken, pork, and seafood. They also have some vegetables and noodles as well. They also have set meals called solo, solo for those who cannot decide what to order. For our first dish, this is called sizzling tofu. I guess it's tofu only because it's not sizzling anymore. It looks creamy and looks nice with those spring onions on top. You can see how the tofu was finely fried. The sauce seems thick and smells buttery. Look how the sauce coats the tofu so well. Now let us try our first bite. Here we go. I like the texture of the tofu. It has this crispy crust and moist texture inside. It's also kind of savory taste as well. Our second dish is called fried dangus. Dangus in English is called milkfish. Milkfish has a firm texture with a mild, sweet taste. That color black is the fat which is my mom's favorite. You can see how the meat was so white. This seems looks fresh. The only thing is it's kinda greasy to be honest. The fish was so tender. It has some kinda subtle sour taste. Maybe because of the vinegar. But overall I like it. Next is this pancit palabok. Pancit palabok is a type of Filipino noodle dish that makes use of cornstarch. Sticks, which is also known as palabok noodles. It has an orange sauce composed of minced pork, tinapa flakes, and annatto water. It's so creamy looking at a first glance. Noodles was so thin and bit enjoyable in your mouth. Next dish is the care care. A uniquely Filipino dish made with simmer, oxtail, vegetables, and peanut, base sauce. You can see how this has so thick sauce because of the peanut. A huge chunks of beef are in it as well. Looks tender. Care care was usually partnered with bagoon. But this one is already tasty no need for bagoon for me. I like how the string beans were included. It has additional texture to this dish. Pure beef cut. It was so good and so tender. I really like this dish so far. Highly recommended for you guys to try. They also have some side dishes. We call this cancon. This one is fried cracker. I like this one. This seems crunchy and salty. We call this one as in salada. Side dish mixed with onions, tomato, and cucumber. Last is fried sweet potato. This is kind of appetizer. And now for the most awaited part of the video. Let us try this famous crispy pad. It looks well deeply cooked in hot boiling oil. It has its sweet so sauce and atsara on the side. Looking at the meat seems tender. I'm excited to try this one. This looks crunchy and juicy when meat. Let us get some atsara to add additional taste to it. Atsara is fermented shredded papaya. Kinda sweet taste. Mm. 
you can see how tender the meat is and cook perfectly. Of course, we need to try this crispy pata skin. So crunchy, and I really love this one. Watch this if you want more of this kind of video.